So now we're going to measure active and passive range of motion. Um, say that your client has limited range of motion in the elbow. You're going to the active. You're going to have the client raise their arm as much as they can, and you're going to take that measurement. So the active range of motion is going to be about 120 degrees. So to measure passive range of motion, you will raise the arm as much as it will allow you to go, and then you will take a measurement. And so the passive range of motion is 140 degrees.